Well, it's been just two days since we got our first look at renovation plans for Bank of America Stadium, and many of you have contacted us with questions about the price tag. Some are wondering why the city would have to dish out money and whether this is a common practice. WCNZ Charlotte's Megan Bragg has the answers in this morning's Verify. And this proposed plan costs around $800 million for renovations. The city of Charlotte is expected to pay $650 million broken out over the length of the agreement. So there's been a lot of questions on social media about this. this these are actually from Reddit and they have people asking why the city is paying part of the cost and if this is common. So let's break this all down for you. To verify, we went to these three teams and the city of Charlotte. So first, this is not an uncommon practice. The Buffalo Bills are in the process of constructing their new stadium with an estimated cost of $1.7 billion. Now, taxpayers are footing $850 million for that stadium, and our neighbors to the northwest, the Tennessee Titans, are building an estimated $2.1 billion stadium. The city and state has reached an agreement, and they plan to pay $1.26 billion. And back up north, we have the Baltimore Ravens. Their three year contracts for MT Bank Stadium renovations will cost the state around $430 million. So we can verify that, yes, this is common for public funding to be allocated when it comes to renovations of stadiums. You might remember earlier this week, we verified that these funds will not come from any new taxes. The city of Charlotte says the funds would come from the Convention Center Fund, which is derived from sales taxes and is legally required to be spent on projects to support the city's tourism economy. With your Verify, I'm Megan Bragg. If you have something you would like verified, just email us at verify at wcnc.com.